this computer has Windows Defender running on it. So we can actually disable that entirely. I'll show you a secret. You guys want to see a secret? Visit your help. So go to however you get there, like through here. And go to your home and click on search. And then type in restart. And it says change advanced startup options. Okay. And then click on restart now. And what we're going to do is we're going to boot into the command shell and we're going to rename the Windows Defender folder so that it can't load anymore. <laughs> it's, a, it's a sneaky way to deactivate it. You see all these people on the internet who are trying to deactivate it and nobody can seem to figure out how to do it. Um, it's easy. Just make it so Windows can't find it anymore. Click on command prompt. There we go. Command prompt mode is kind of like safe mode, but you don't actually have Windows. You just have a command prompt. There it is. That's it. So C drive is where you want to go. So C drive, program files, do a directory. And there you go. You see Windows Defender folder. So all we're going to do is we're going to type in move Windows Defender. And we're just going to call it stop running. You battered. There, that's it. So now if we exit, now we can continue on to Windows 10. And when it boots up, you're gonna see the little shield is still gonna be there, but Windows Defender itself is going to be gone. Okay, so we're back in. So check this out. Um, now that we're booted up, if you look down here, there's our Windows security shield that we normally have. But take a look on the left. There's no more Windows Defender. That's it. So even if you view the task manager, so we'll control shift escape, load up a task manager here. Um, again, nothing. Like you can see here, we got lots of processes running. All these things doing things. But look at that, doesn't that make you feel good having a computer without Windows Defender? Now, you have to remember that we just removed all virus ability. So if you're one of those people who downloads these applications that make your computer faster or clean your registry or all this like Trojan and spyware stuff, if you're one of those people that think that you have to install all these applications because they're utilities that you love so much, yeah, well, it's not going to protect you from that virus or that Trojan because you just removed Windows Defender. So stop installing crap that you don't need. All you need is ARC. That's it.